Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Are you interested in selling your domain on Bluehost? In this guide, we will show you how to steps on listing, promoting and completing the sale of your domain on Bluehost. So guys, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you can have the full experience. So guys, in this video, I will need you to go ahead and open bluehost.com. Right after that, log into your account, which is going to be pretty simple. Simply sign in with Google and you will be right into there. Then right after you do so, you will have to go to the home page and click on domains. Here you will have to own a domain in the first place so you can sell it. So getting a domain in Bluehost, there is two main methods. Either you buy it directly, so you search here for a domain name, for example, uh, let's search for Cristiano, for example, and click on search. Right through this page, I would be able to actually find various amount of sites or domain names that has Cristiano on them, and I can buy them. Now, these domains, I will acquire them on Bluehost, directly from Bluehost and from this platform, and the money that I'm going to pay is going to be going to Bluehost. The second method of owning a website or a domain name in Bluehost is by transferring a domain from another platform. For example, I bought a domain on GoDaddy and I'm willing to transfer it to Bluehost. So this is the second method, so there is two ways. Now how can we sell this domain? For this specific reason, we are going to actually go by this guide which is made by Bluehost blog. So step-by-step -step guide on how to sell a domain name. Let's get started. First of all, learning to sell a domain can be a length process. And it's not always simple. However, if you want to sell a domain or try trading domains, you need to learn how to do it right. With the right tools, you can get the best price for your domains and avoid payment scams. Keep reading to learn why do you want to sell a domain and how to sell a domain name. Of course, why do we want to sell domain? Well, uh, basically because we want to make money. Or basically there is no need for that specific domain in our uh, in our dashboard, so we don't need it. The why not sell it? So, there is three platform or main platform that you can sell your domains in: Afternake, Flippa, and Seto. So these all all the three main marketplaces where you can sell your domain and there is also other platforms such as Namecheap etc. Now the price of your domain it can be very very dependent on a lot of factors. For example now if I went to GoDaddy and I went to Namecheap and Bluehost also. So there we go. Let me search for domain in here for example domains Cristiano and the same domain I'm going to search for it on other platforms so domains there we go search and go to the domain search let's see the domain pricing so the domain pricing nowadays for .com is $13 but what is the trend in 2024 and 2023 what are the new inventions that are basically taking the market AI, chat GPT, and mid journey. So when you try to go and search for the prices of AI, I don't think they exist in uh, in here. So with this domain, so let's check for example GoDaddy. If I want to go there and we try to search for AI, as you can see, the price is here one dollar, zero point zero one cent, one dollar, and for AI, it's sixty dollar. And usually it can go up till 139. The same thing here for AI, $80. So basically that's because they are the trend, they have higher value in the market and there is a higher chance that you can sell them. So choosing the correct domain name and that will help you a lot to increase its price. So for example here, uh, there is a various other things that can impact it, such as the length. A single word domain tend to be more valuable because simply the single word domain is easier to be remembered and, and iconic of course 
and basically it can have a meaning so one word will have several me one meaning but instead for example you are going to write a phrase dot com well that's a lot of words and people will not be willing to actually tap the whole phrase to get access to that specific website so that is why the length of a single word can be very more valu valuable and with length it counts more reliability as long as the length of your domain is short the people will remember it even more. Now, there is also top level domains. If you are willing to get the domain, you will probably want to get .com, .org, .io, and .net. Nowadays, you will come to .ai and .bot. So, the, these are the main ones which will work always for you, but there is the ones that come for this specific period of time when there is a trend. So, for example, there is .ai, .bot nowadays which we have talked about. Of course, there is the age, older domains are more valuable and relevance to popular brands, topics or products. So, for example, if you have a name that is close to a brand or something like that, you will have more possibility that you are going to sell it. Now, how can we sell that specific domain? Well, it's pretty simple. You simply have to go and check out the main marketplaces like Zero, Flippa and Afternik, as we said before. They are like the eBay for the domain names, just list it, set your price, and potential buyers can come knocking on your door. Remember, the right price and a good domain can make the difference. How much can I sell the domain name for? Well, as we talked about in this video, there are several conditions, like the length, like if it is memorable, uh, if it has like a uh, unique meaning, etc., etc., etc. If you go, if you do have everything like so, you can check the marketplace itself of these platforms and check for a good uh, for the prices and just take the average and put it as your price. Now again, how do domain name marketplaces work? Think of them as online storefronts. You list your domain potential buyers browse. And if they are interested, they will make an offer or buy outright. The marketplace all often handles the transaction, ensuring it's smooth and secure for both parties. How does the domain auction site work since there will be an auction for your domain? Since uh, there will be two kinds of prices. The buy now price, which is for example, if you want to buy this domain right now, you have to pay 520 but if you want to get into auction, well, you have to start from 500, for example. So there is an auction that's going on in the in like in the meta right now. So there will be a lot of people that can raise up the price of your domain too much more than you think. And that's pretty much it. So you have to use one of these third party apps so you can sell your Bluehost domains. And see you guys in the next tutorials.